All right, guys, let's talk about Shinobi Strikers. Um, it's been kind of the elephant in the room when it came to the Naruto series and video games. Um, some people like it, some people hate it, some people are kind of indifferent to it. Personally, I like it a lot. Um, I think there's a lot of potential in it, uh, especially since they officially announced character creation um, at Gamescom this past week. Uh, a lot of people still don't like it, even though it's exactly what people wanted in the game. Uh, and with the with the way they're showing the character creator, I can't see nothing but positive look from it. Yeah, like so far we, it seems like there's not a lot of hairstyles from it. Um, but we do get to choose weapons. We do get to choose uh, jutsus. There's it doesn't seem like the fighting styles are stuck on a certain character's jutsu so we can mix and match. We can have like Hinata's air palm with uh, Sasuke's Kirin or Kirin, however you want to say it. Um, the fact that they didn't lock it down, the combo is down to whatever moves you want to use is a great plus in my book. Um, otherwise, oh come on, <laughs> basically a mirror match. <laughs> All right, uh, no, I think I got this, I got this. Um, anyways, the fact that they're not locked down is a great thing. Um, now, I saw something about a story mode. I could have been wrong. I could have saw like, a, the wrong scan or like the wrong article. Um, but if it's like an online story mode where we could, like have to make like a clan or something like that, it would be really cool. I would have really enjoyed like, playing with my friends in the game online. We're doing that. I don't know what I would name my clan, though. Like, If you guys have the option to make a clan in the game, this guy sounds good. If you have the option to make a, like a clan in this game, like would you base it off the Uchiha, the Uzumaki, or would you just make a whole brand new one? Um, or what of this? What of this? Um, what if you had to choose a clan at the beginning of the game, and then whatever character you create, that's the clan they're in? Um, come on, dude. Your Sarada's not better than my Sarada. Um, yeah. So, like, would you guys like? You know, kind of being like filtered into a clan at the beginning of the game, or would you prefer making your own? Oh, that's like Bessie. You better not quit on me. You better not quit on me. I'm doing pretty good right now. Sit your ass down. Now, what do you guys think about the weapons in the game? The, the like so far, we've seen uh, samurai sword, Kisame's sword. Uh, we saw Hidan's scythe. Now, I really want uh, Naruto's batons he got from when he uh, became Sage Mode, uh, six pass Sage Mode Naruto. Oh damn, he got me with that. Cause those were things were badass. Like those little batons where he can pretty much I don't know I, did he throw them or, no those, those were the those were the true secret balls um he didn't throw the batons but like Naruto with the weapon was bad yeah he had a kunai before but come on everyone has kunai yeah I really think he's gonna win just because he became Susana so uh oh yeah so oh so far uh, the characters we have in the game it doesn't seem like a big list. We have, I'm pretty sure, of course, we have Naruto, we have Sasuke, we have Sakura, Kakashi, um, Hinata, Rock Lee, Boruto, I'm pretty sure there's Choji and maybe Shikamaru? Oh, and then uh, then we have Pain, Pain, Itachi. I th did I say Itachi already? I felt like I said Itachi already. Um, we have him, Kasame, and Konan. You know, so the roster is not small, but we don't have everyone. Uh, come on, dude, that's not gonna hit me. We don't have everyone yet, and that may be a problem with, you know, the way people are gonna be playing online and the PvP. Um, you know, it doesn't really matter when we do the missions, but to change it up, you know, every once in a while, you want to play us like someone different. I might be too good for this guy. <laughs> um, yeah, like, I feel like they're gonna add some more. At least, at least, 
maybe the Hokages. Like, we still need to have Tsunade, uh, Rochimaru, Jirai, you know, the three Sonin. Um, uh, we need the third Hokage, the first Hokage, the second Hokage, the fourth Hokage. Uh, and then if they want to, you know, since with the idea of like the character creators being from different villages, we need to have the other, you know, Kage is from the different villages, like a um, the the, the Rai Kage, the Mizu Kage, the Suchi Kage. And is there one more? I can't remember. If there's one more. Um, I might be I might be wrong. But let me finish this up before I get to my next slot, because this guy's almost dead, and I am still on my first stock of life. I wanted to end it with an ultimate jutsu to give this guy a farewell, but oh well. <laughs> um, you know what? We're gonna we're gonna continue with my Shinobi Striker ramble in the next fight. So see you guys in a few seconds. All right, guys, we're back for the second fight, and we're gonna continue my conversation about Shinobi Striker. Um, so where I left off, I was talking about the the Kages and the Hokages and everything. Now, with that being said, do you think there will be like a free roam? Like, are we gonna get to are we gonna get to like travel between the villages or anything? Because if we are, oh, okay, I'm doing pretty good actually. Uh, if we are, that'd be an awesome way to actually learn jutsus. I know they have this like VR virtual reality thing in the game for the characters. It's not real VR, guys. So I know a lot of some of you guys think it is, but it's not. Um, Uh, I know they have that in there to to learn, you know, the jutsus, but I feel like there has to be another way to do it. We can't, we can't all just go to this place to learn jutsu, especially since it's an online game. There has to be some kind of traveling in this game to make it worthwhile, especially since the CACs come. At least they looks like, at least they look like they come from different places. There we go, that switch right there. Otherwise, like, if we're just gonna be staying in the... The Leaf Village? I mean, it's not that bad. I mean, Xenoverse kinda... Xenoverse 1 kinda did the same thing. And I feel like they are taking a book out of Xenoverse. Um, or a page out of Xenoverse, that's a book. <laughs> that would mean they copied the whole thing. I was about to say, you better not quit on me, dude. Oh, that would've been so awesome if that hit him. That would've been, like, dumbass. <laughs> Get me down on the ground. Got you now. There we go. Yeah, so if it seems like they're taking a page out of Xenoverse 1, where it looks like we'll stay in one particular town. And if we do, then, you know, so be it. But I want some travel in this game. There has to be something where we can go meet other people, you know, actual story characters. Not, I'm not talking about, like, players. I mean, like, we should be able to go see, uh... If we're, like, if we want to learn some of Orochimaru's moves, we should be able to go to his little hideout and meet, like, Ka uh, Karin and... what's his name? Um, Sugetsu and Jugo. That would be pretty awesome. Dude, I knew what you were gonna do. Your record was pretty high, but you're pretty. Your, your moves are obvious. <laughs> Sorry, I'm cutting back and forth between sh sh ah, Shinobi Striker, uh, you know, and this game. This guy's just. He's good, but he's not, like, giving me, like, a hard challenge. I might, uh, I might have to take that back though. I'm playing a little bit sloppy right now. Come on, give me my subs back. Give me my subs back. No, that's not gonna happen right here, boy. Ooh. That was 
almost close. He wants to finish this right now. Ah, he got me. He got me. I got distracted. Got you, boy. Got you. <laughs> uh, you know we're just gonna we're just gonna finish that Shinobi Striker combo in another video because I do not want to lose this. Damn it! I <laughs> still lost. <laughs> that was really fun, guys. Um, if you guys enjoyed my Shinobi Striker, you know, combo, even though I wasn't finished with it. Let me know down in the comment section below. If you guys enjoyed the fights, please let me know too because I think they were pretty awesome. Uh, this guy came back over a pretty good win and you know what, I'm gonna give him a little shout out. It's a uh, X crucially high or crucially high. I don't know how to say that. Um, but anyway, so, uh, hey man, you did a good job in this fight and I hope to get to fight you later on. Um, but that's it for me guys. See you guys in the next video. Later.